Welcome back to Sepang. I'm Nick Harris sitting alongside me, Matt Burt, down in pit lane. Dylan Gray for this penultimate round. Can the Yamahas match the pace and the speed of the Hondas at the front? Stay with us because we are about to find out. He's 329th Grand Prix appearance. It's a new record P world title. Lorenzo's leading the sighting lap, and that's a, that's a good start, <laughs> yeah. isn't it? Up towards turn four. Dylan, track conditions. Look, it's going to be fine. Uh, it is quite hot and humid. It is a little bit warmer than it was in Moto2, but the good thing is this uh, rain that they thought might come has stayed away. That doesn't mean that the teams won't be prepared. Uh, there could be a few interesting things with regards to wet tyre choice should they need to switch onto the number two bike. However, I don't think we should get into that right now because as we stand, like you guys said, medium front, medium rear, it's going to be a straight shootout. Ooh. Take a dick. Big, deep breath at home. Jorge Lorenzo, Danny Petrosa, a little bit of a wiggle there from Andrea to Yanona. And there he is, Valentino Rossi in there, also Mark Marquez, certainly not sending Christmas cards to each other at the moment. Just remind you of the situation, Rossi leads that world championship by 11 points. Will he be crowned the new champion? The world waits with bated breath. The 2015 Malaysian Grand